And as we said, it is the first day of school for students in Broken Arrow. News on 6's Jonathan Pulasic tells us what's going on in the district this year. It's an exciting time for students here at the Broken Arrow Freshman Academy, as well as for students all over the school district, as the students have started their first day of classes for this new school year. Now, it's going to be a full day for these students here, uh, with that final bell ringing at about 2.35 here at the Freshman Academy. Now, speaking with teachers and staff, they are extremely excited for the year to get underway, as there's a lot of work that goes on behind the scenes before the school starts, the school year starts up. Now, something that's new for all high school students is that they will all be required to wear eye ID badges. Freshman Academy's principal Andy Rice tells me it's all done for safety reasons. We are going to require that our our students have an ID on, and then we're we're trying to find purposes for the students to have them and use them. So so we want to make sure they have them at football games or any other school sponsored activity, so that we can have the use of them, and then that way they have the purpose of having them on every day and keeping our schools safe. Now, even though this school year has started, I did speak with uh, uh, some members of the Broken Arrow Public Schools, and they tell me that they are still short about 26 teachers for this school year, as well as being down about 15 bus drivers. So there's still a need of teachers and bus drivers for this school year. Reporting in Broken Arrow, Jonathan Pulasic, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.